together autumnal. Autumn carved into the land like a grinned, snaggle-toothed pumpkin, fleshy and crooked. Leaves set themselves aflame with a frost-bent ferocity, starting in the secret mountain hollows amongst crackling streams and splintering crows of rock. Then the tree beings screaming, scraping off their pumpkin orange skins to darken valley dance floors, spitting birds of leaves, whole flocks of darting leaves, to bury the fields, attack the rain gutters, and eclipse the ground from light. The creaking and creeping line of darkness advancing, the warmth withdraws south towards the day's lengthening, and other leaves just now greening, swollen buds in a warmer night. But here the light is running, each day bleeding light, the hourglass pouring out leaves in light. A hasty retreat, sucking south swirls of currents and streams, cold fronts kicked up like an icy dust, while thick galaxies of wind batter their way south throwing burnt chips of leaves into blinding zephyrs of wet, glinting golds, as night reveals gales of broke knuckle stars and the cold, old gore of rotting pumpkins, icing creek shallows, and bare, bare trees. While high above the hard gray rock of the sky chips, flakes off crystals of white, ancient white, spinning off to slits of snow that ghosts before our eyes. Yet amongst all this tumult, all this leaf brackish air grinding down overhead, and all these threaded screws of cold turning into these wooden bones of ours, you and I, still found ourselves on that violently lit, blaze-orange, leaf-strewn street corner, with our clacking knees and watering eyes, ready, grinning for winter. <laughs>